on the limited information available, I've made three extrapolations. One, our Martian friend is a carbon-based life form. Two, he breathes nitrogen. And three, the large cerebrum here indicates telepathic potential. You mean they can read our thoughts? Potentially, yes. What about their intentions? Are they a friendly people? Logic dictates that given their extremely high level of technical development, they're an advanced culture, therefore peaceful and enlightened. The human race, on the other hand, is an aggressively dangerous species. Now, I suspect they have more to fear from us than we from them. Dr. Thank you, Professor. For many years, I've been refining a translating computer. The results are not perfect. But this may answer some of your questions. All green of skin. 800 centuries ago, their bodily fluids include the birth of half-breeds. How many centuries did he say? 800, sir. Determination of the cosmos. For dark is the swathe that mows like a harvest. What the hell does that mean? 